Well, hello everyone. Today, we're going to be talking about a story or a parable that Jesus tells that teaches us that we need to pray all the time and never give up when we pray. And the two main characters in the story are a bad judge and a widow. But today, I'm not going to tell you that story. Today, Jacob and Anna are going to tell you what they remember from the story and also a few imaginative extras that they think happened as a part of the story. Let's take a look. There was an unjust judge. The unjust judge was really bad, so... He popped like his wheel on a bike. He ate someone's spaghetti. Or maybe he ate someone's tacos. He didn't let anyone go potty. Or maybe he he he, he didn't go to school. You mean work? Yeah. There was a widow that had a problem, and she went to the unjust judge to. All of her problem, but but the unjust judge didn't want to do it, so she kept bothering him. Maybe she bothered him while he was picking flowers. She bothered him while he was swinging on the monkey bars. She bothered him while he was eating lunch. She, she bo bothered him while he was washing his hands. Maybe she bothered him while he, while he was running laps. He, she bothered him while he was, go, while he was exercising. <coughs> Maybe she was bothering him while he was driving his car. Maybe she bothered him while he was setting a bee trap. And after she asked him a bunch of times, he granted her wish. God's the opposite of the unjust judge. God is good, not bad. God doesn't get annoyed because he never gets tired and he loves us. And again, this parable teaches us that we need to keep asking God and praying to God for everything that we need and to never give up. Because in this story, the unjust judge is not a good person. And yet he still gives the widow exactly what she asks for because she doesn't give up. She keeps asking him for what she needs. And the great news is that God is nothing like this bad judge. In fact, God is the exact opposite. God loves us. God wants to give us what we need. And God wants us to keep asking him, keep praying to him for everything that we need. Because that's one of the ways that we keep growing in our relationship with God. It's one of the ways that we keep showing our love for God. And it reminds us that we need and rely on God. And that's why we should keep praying to him and never give up. Anyway, I hope that helps you understand this parable just a little bit better. Goodbye, everyone.